Hey guys, Nathan here from Drawboard. Hope you're doing really well. Um, I'm working from home today. I'm working remotely, which is the perfect place to share with you three tips on how to use Bullclip for your remote teamwork. So Bullclip is used uh, heavily by the design, engineering and architecture industries, which is what it was created for originally. Uh, but the truth is that PDF collaboration can, is needed by every document heavy industry. Uh, so Bullclip isn't just limited to those industries. So there are three areas which I recommend you check out in Bullclip. The first thing is uh, Bullclip is a real time remote workspace. That was the basis of what we created in the, at, at the start. So if I go into a drawing, here. Uh, I can see there's a lot going on on this drawing. I can see there's multiple people here that I can turn on and off. But if I was to zoom into this area on the web app and I've got my uh, Android phone here. And if I do an annotation on my phone on the same drawing, that's going to appear in real time no matter where I am in the world on any other device. It doesn't matter if you're in Seattle or London or Melbourne, whether you're at, in the office or you're working from home, the experience is the same. Uh, I'm going to see everything appear just as it's applied. Now, I can use the draft layer first and publish to the public layer, uh, but for, for, we treat collaboration as standard in Bullclip. That's really important for, for example, uh, meetings when you uh, need to, everyone in the same place on the same drawing and then you need to refer back to all those and who made what changes and when uh, later and after the meeting. So the second area that Bullclip helps with uh, in terms of remote work is uh, guest access. So if I jump into my team here, yes, I can invite a, a Bullclip team member, so someone who has a license, but I can also invite external guests. So I can invite someone, say, as a collaborator for five days, and they'll just get a link in an email. They click on the link, they jump into the drawing or the document that you want reviewed, and they leave their markups, and then they get out. They don't need a Bullclip license. You don't need to worry about managing heaps of heaps of different licenses uh, and it's just it's easy for everyone that's one of the crux uh, one of the core points of bull clip is that what we want to do is make it easy for everyone to get on board the third thing is that we do revision stacking uh, now this is not a unique thing but it's really important for remote work because if you're like me I lose track of revisions I lose track of what the current revision is of a document that I'm reviewing um, and it takes me a lot of work to uh, have to keep everyone else up to date as to what's latest so I know that if I jump into something in bull clip uh, it is the latest revision now I and my team members can jump back into old revisions and I can see who made what changes and who marked things up but those markups are locked out so you can't edit an old uh, revisions markups so that's that's really it. So you've got um, real-time workspace. Bullclip is real-time. Uh, you've got guest access. I can invite anyone from anywhere, any time, anywhere, <laughs> um, as uh, as a guest user. They don't need a license. And the fact that you can stack revisions in Bullclip so you have uh, a markup and audit history of what happened and when. The only other thing I'd add is that in Bullclip, uh, your licenses are account based, so you don't have a, a device based license that makes it harder to carry around uh, where, wherever you are. Uh, I can log into the iOS app, the Windows 10 app, uh, the web app. I was on the web app on my, on my, my Android phone, uh, and I've got access to the latest markups, the latest documents, uh, and really my team members wherever they are as well. So that's it. If you have any questions, please reach out uh, at support at bullclip.com, uh, especially about remote work. We really want to help you guys out. So until next time, see you later.